What's going on guys? Cameron here with the Lawn Care Life in Missouri. Hey, it's a wrap. Check it out, man. Finally got the box truck lettered up. Finally got the wrap on there. Uh, this is something that I wanted to do for a long time now. I picked up the new box truck last year. I was hoping to get it wrapped last year, but uh, I didn't get the box truck quick enough and the season started and I was out busy mowing, trying to get things done and didn't have time to get it wrapped. So over the winter, I set things up and I was hoping to get it wrapped a lot sooner than this. It's uh, the last of March. I think it's March 31st is today's date. And I was hoping to get it done a lot quicker than this. I was hoping to get it done actually by March 1st, but um, it took a little longer than expected. But the good news is we got it done. Let's check it out. As a lot of you guys know that have been following me for a while on my old box truck I actually did the logo um, on the box truck myself it was just a basic you know vinyl lettering slap the logo on there but this time around with the new box truck I wanted to have a more professional look and man I think they did a really great job doing that so I'm really hoping the wrap will hold up for a long time uh, hopefully it'll give me several years of, uh, of advertisement um, you know, this is actually a rolling billboard now. A lot of guys have enclosed trailers. They do the same thing. Uh, the cool thing about it is anywhere you go, if you wanted to uh, strictly advertise, you know, maybe on the weekends, check out those areas that are really, really populated. A lot of people are, you know, hanging out in those areas of those neighborhoods. You can drive around and basically advertise for free. It's going to cost you a little bit in fuel, especially with this box truck, but for the most part, um, you know, this is a relatively low cost compared to, you know, what type of exposure you're going you're gonna to get with the mobile billboard. You know, if you think about it, you could spend a whole lot of money uh, throwing out door hangers, flyers, going around different neighborhoods, uh, but the return on investment just isn't a whole lot. You maybe get one, two percent return on investment with those door hangers, flyers. You can put out yard signs. Those are great too. Not saying those things don't work. Uh, they work really well actually, but um, for the best bang for your buck, man, you spend the money one time, you get the wrap, you get the advertisement, the mobile billboard all over your enclosed trailer or box truck or pickup truck, whatever you have. And then, you know, every single day when you're out working in those neighborhoods, you're actually advertising for your lawn care or landscaping business. And that's the cool thing about the wraps, the mobile billboards, anywhere you go. So you want to target different areas, you can actually target different neighborhoods. Maybe you got a big event going on, uh, maybe on the weekend, you want to swing by that event and just park your truck out next to it and you're going to get a lot of eyeballs, a lot of attention on it. So if you guys are looking for ways to grow your business, uh, gain more exposure in your area, man, check out the mobile billboards, check out vinyl lettering, check out the vinyl wraps. I'm telling you, man, it's, uh, it's definitely worth the money to, uh, to go ahead and spend the money to get it done. I know a lot of guys have enclosed trailers. They have uh, a lot of them are plain. Some of them have a few vinyl decals on there, but if you get the thing wrapped, I'm telling you, you're going to turn heads. People in your area are going to notice you and your name's going to start spreading like crazy. As I shared with you guys about a month or so ago, Wyatt with Wyatt's Lawn Service on YouTube, he had a video out, 2020 goals. He shared his goals. He nominated other guys. He nominated me to share my goals. So uh, I had a video out that shared my goals for 2020. This was one of my major goals. I can check that off the list now. Wyatt, thanks for the nomination. And uh, man, it just feels good to check one of those things off the list. We'll see how the rest of the season goes, see if I can check those other things off the list. But uh, anyways, guys, I'm Cameron with the Lawn Care Life in Missouri. Uh, thanks for checking out this quick video. Thanks for checking out the wrap. Let me know what you guys think of it. Let me know what you guys um, do in your lawn care landscaping business. Do you have a vinyl wrap? Uh, do you have lettering on your truck or trailers? Put a comment in the below and uh, let me know, guys. All right. Hope you have a blessed day. And as always, God provides. So one more thing real quick before you guys go. Check this out. So I actually partnered up with my local dealer here in town, B&W Lawnmower Repair and Sales. They got the Ferris, they got the Echo, 
partnered up with my local dealer, gonna do some advertising for them as well. So when I'm out and about in town, not only am I advertising for my lawn care business, but for those that uh, don't need the service, I can advertise right here for uh, for customers that need a mower or maybe uh, you know other lawn care guys are out seeing my truck um, all over town. They're gonna be like, man, where'd he get that Ferris? Where'd he get that Echo? Right there, BMW Lawnmower.